Hi guys, this is Mike here at Mac Observer, and today I'll show you how to fix macOS install stuck, Ventura, Monterey, Sierra, and more. Installing new macOS versions on a Mac is typically expected to be simple and uncomplicated. However, there are occasions where unforeseen challenges may arise, causing the installation to deviate from the intended path. What are the steps to resolve issues encountered when macOS installation becomes stuck? Keep watching to find out, it's easy. Try these tips one by one to fix your Mac OS install getting stuck woes. A poor internet connection could be the reason your installation is taking so long. To fix this, here are a few things you should try. Make sure your device is close to the router. Turn Wi-Fi on and off. Change your Wi-Fi connection and at the end, restart your Mac. Apple occasionally experiences server issues, hence it's worth taking a moment to check the system status. To do this, go to Apple's system status page and locate Mac OS software update in the list to see if there are any issues. Please note that downloads won't continue if your Mac is in sleep mode. Therefore, ensuring that your Mac remains turned on to download the update successfully is vital. Here's how. Select the main Apple menu's system preferences battery. Select battery from the left-hand list and toggle the setting for turn the display off after to never. You may switch it back to your preferred settings when you are done with the installation. Temporary, corrupt, or broken files can interfere with Mac's performance. Removing this clutter from your system with a reliable tool can give it the needed boost to perform otherwise simple tasks, such as downloading and installing an operating system. Steps to resolve Mac OS Ventura install stuck. If Mac OS Ventura is taking forever to install, try these tips one by one to fix the issue. Sometimes, freeing up space on your Mac may prove to be very challenging. It may feel like you need every file on the system, and there is simply nothing to delete. If this is the case, you should consider getting an external storage device. Installing the Ventura update in safe mode is a very effective way to solve the Mac OS Ventura stuck issue. To do this for Intel-based Macs, shut down your Mac from the main menu then. After about 10 seconds, switch it back on while pressing down the Shift key. As soon as you see the login window, release the key. Shut down your Mac from the main menu then. After about 10 seconds, switch it back on while pressing down the shift key. As soon as you see the login window, release the key. Select Macintosh HD, startup disk, and hold down the shift key. Then press continue and release the key. Apple has a native built-in storage optimization tool, which is a great way to free up space on your Mac. Click on the Apple menu and select about this Mac. Click on Storage. In the sidebar, click on Recommendations. Follow the on-screen instructions to enable a recommendation. It may happen that the best solution to fix macOS Monterey taking forever to install is to be a little patient. Keep in mind that the installation process can take a significant amount of time. So instead of panicking, simply wait or occupy yourself with other activities. However, if there is still no progress after a considerable amount of time, it's time to take action. Manually restart your Mac. This will cancel the installation of the update, and you will need to restart the update process. The software update will resume from where it stopped, but it's likely to finish the update faster than if you did not restart the system. FileVault is a powerful security feature integrated into Mac to identify and combat unauthorized data access. However, this tool can sometimes interfere with the update process, and you may need to turn it off to successfully install Mac OS Monterey. To do this, navigate to the Apple menu on the home screen and click on it, and select System Settings. Click on Privacy and Security, and navigate to File Vault tab. Select Turn Off, fill in the administrator name and password, and click on Unlock button. Update the system and check if the issue persists. To do this, follow the steps listed and explained under the Mac OS Ventura Install Stuck section. Install in safe mode. You may also want to try re-downloading and installing Mac OS Monterey. Here are the fixes to try if your Mac OS Sierra install is stuck. Reinstalling Mac OS in recovery mode ensures that you install Sierra without losing any data. To do this, Restart your Mac and hold down Command plus R to boot your Mac into recovery mode. Then, restart your Mac once again while holding down Command plus Option plus R to enter Internet recovery mode. 
choose Install a new copy of Mac OS and wait until the installation is complete. If the above steps have failed, you can try resetting NVRM and SMC as a last resort. NVRM is a section of your Mac that deals with computer memory. It stores data like screen resolution and volume settings. To reset NVRM, hold down Command plus Option plus P plus R for about 20 seconds during the startup process. Similarly, to reset SMC, hold down Shift plus Control plus Option on the left side of the keyboard and press the power button at the same time. Additionally, remember to back up your important data before attempting any troubleshooting steps. After downloading Mac OS Catalina or Mojave, it often happens that your Mac may get stuck when installing the new OS. Follow the steps below to fix Mac OS Catalina taking forever to install. A major reason why Mac OS installation gets stuck on estimating time remaining is that it's not fully compatible with the requirements of Mac OS Catalina Mojave for your Mac. You need to check the requirements of the new Mac OS and ensure that it's compatible with your Mac version. A lack of sufficient storage space is another common issue that Mac owners face when installing Mac OS Catalina Mojave updates. Remember that Mac OS Catalina Mojave requires a significant amount of storage space. Because of this need for ample storage space, Apple recommends having at least 20 GB of free disk space on your MacBook to install these Mac OS versions effectively. To check your Mac's available storage space, for this, go to Apple menu and navigate to about this Mac's storage. If you're experiencing installation issues, try installing Mac OS Catalina or Mojave in safe mode. This can help bypass any conflicting software or drivers. Refer to the Mac OS Ventura Install Stuck section on this page and follow the steps listed to install Mac OS Catalina or Mojave in safe mode. That's it for today guys. If the installation is still stuck, you can try reinstalling Mac OS from the Mac OS recovery option. This allows you to perform a fresh installation without losing your data. Refer to the Mac OS Sierra install stuck subheading and follow the steps listed to reinstall Mac OS Catalina or Mojave from Mac OS recovery option. Don't forget to like and subscribe at Mac Observer for more intuitive guides, tips, and Apple news. This is Mike here. See you next time.